sigma notation. How do we do it, Mike? Let a n equal the sum from k is 1, so the first term to the nth term, of this sequence 4k minus 1, show that a n is equal to this quadratic. Okay, so with your 13, guys, you need to know the two forms of arithmetic and geometric sequences in sigma notation, and then just apply the same general rules. So here, we've got a linear sequence, which means that this is a sum of arithmetic sequences, okay? So, here is my, my sequence, in this case we're dealing with k, uk is a plus k minus 1 d. But if you guys mix up the n's and the k's, it makes no difference, okay? So, the question is, how can you identify what a and d are just from this? Well, you could go back to GCSE, and you would know that the coefficient of the unknown tells you what the sequence is going up by, because 4k just means the 4 times tables. So immediately, I know that d is quattro. But what about a, the first term? Well, you find the first term by substituting in 1 into our general sequence, okay? Essentially, this equals 4k minus 1. Now, what do we do when we, well, what do we get when we sub in 1? We'll get 4 times 1 minus 1, which is 3. Okay, so this here was when k is 1. Okay, and if you sub in k is 1 into here, you're just left with a. It's just here we actually have the sequence. So, we can now find the general term of the sequence by doing sn, or an, doesn't really matter. So, an is sn in our notation, is n over 2, 2a, plus n minus 1d, which is n over 2, which we don't know, 2a, 2 times 3, 6, plus n minus 1, d is quattro. You can multiply in the 2 now, or you could uh, expand and simplify. I'm going to multiply in the 2. 2 cancels the 6 3 times, cancels the 4 twice, multiply that in. So you get n, lots of 3, plus 2n, minus dos, which when we simplify that is 2n plus 1, which when we expand, we get 2n squared plus n, and that, my friends, is our an. So guys, like this video, save this video, share with a mate, repost it, all that good stuff, help a brother and sister out who's doing the A-levels, in it, and follow for more maths content. Nice.